Hello, how are you everybody? How are you doing? Good morning and good day and good afternoon wherever you are. Depending on the location where you are, you are blessed. God is on your side and heaven is backing up your point. So uh, today I want to fulfill my promise on the other videos where I said I will continue to bring a lot of information and a lot of uh, secret about uh, the wonderful seed of uh, Algeta Pepe. Now, for the sake of those people that uh, have seen uh, all other videos of my Algeta Pepe, Algeta Pepe is this one in my hand. This is Algeta Pepe. It's a wonderful seed. It's a seed that mostly you can find it from uh, West Africa countries. It's rarely to be found in Eastern countries and all other part countries of the world. But uh, in some other part of the country, like uh, North America, you can find them. Uh, there are places in America where you can find them. You can access, have access to them. If you go to the uh, shops of the people who are black there, you can find them. There are many places you can find them, but uh, they are very rarely in many other places. Agatha pepper is a wonderful seed. It's a spice that uh, can be used to cook in the market and it has a lot of a lot of benefit a lot of benefit and um, uh, this one and uh, as i said on the other day um, in Ebo land uh, there is called osioje osioje hmm? in a in a yoruba the other day i corrected i said in yoruba they call it atta Atta. Okay, so um, Atta means uh, it is something that uh, a spirit that is waiting a command. Just command something and it will, it will carry it to implement, uh, implementation. Okay, so this seed, uh, information about the seed has gone. Uh, extended now in, in various places and uh, some people are talking a lot about the seed some people have information from the their childhood when they are growing up because the seed existed from their place so um, they know much about from their forefathers from their um, ancestors who have been training them when they grow up or some people have information of uh, just uh, they hear some other people talk about it and then they begin to use it without considering a lot of things i am coming up with this information with the three dimension the first dimension i bring this information of agatha pepe is by experience having experienced what it can do in my own life. Experience what it can do in my own life, then I have an information about it. Number two, I bring this Agatha Pepe information on this line because of the knowledge. I have acquired enough knowledge about Agatha Pepe. Uh, some people may think uh, when you you make a, a mistake or something, you don't have information. Like I said, information is very, very important in life. I've seen people who have died because of lack of information. Information is power. Knowledge is power. And when you are not informed, you are deformed. A lot of people who are deforming their life is because some of them because of the lack of information. Information is knowledge and it is very important. The Bible says without knowledge, a man, a man's life rendered to nothing. Because in Hosea, the word of God says, my people perish because of lack of knowledge. And a lot of people are taken in captivity because of lack of information. And I'm not talking about any knowledge. No, I'm talking about the true knowledge, the right knowledge, 
the knowledge that is backed up with the light, the knowledge that is backed up with the word of God. And therefore, this is the true knowledge. If you want to discover something, you have to look at the manufacturer of that person. Ask the manufacturer of that person. The third area that uh, I bring this information to you is by the revelation of the spirit of, cre of the creator. He is the manufacturer of all these things. If you want information about this tablet or this camera, you talk to the people who have manufactured the camera, you talk to them, the Nokia people or the Sony people, you ask them. The Samsung people, you ask them. They will give you information about Samsung, about the, this uh, camera, uh, uh, the Sony people, they will talk to you a lot. They have everything about, uh, about the camera. The capacity of the camera, what the camera can do. Eh? So th that's why I told you the other day. When I bring this information on the line, I am not here to joke. As you can see my age, I'm old man now. I don't have games to play. I'm a minister of the gospel. I come here to help somebody. So the information here, the only person who can give accurate and maximize potential of this uh, seed in my hand is the Holy Spirit, the maker of heaven and earth, the one who knows the beginning and how he has positioned this spirit and the natural power he has infected in this spirit, in this seed, he is the one who can maximize it. So this is a seed that can bring a change in your life. This is a seed that can bring a solution in many, many things. God can use this seed to change your life as you hear God can use anything. So you just need to acquire information, get knowledge, have understanding, and uh, seek to know the guidelines or the guidelines, eh? the rules, eh? and just observe the rules and apply the knowledge and uh, it shall work for you. Okay? It shall work for you. There are many things you can do with it. Having observed the rules, I said, if you want to embark on any spiritual thing with uh, this seed, you want to use it for any spiritual purpose, then you have to take uh, caution. You have to observe the rules about it. And there are also a natural, uh, like um, you want to apply it in a medical way, or like uh, just a hub, a herbal way to help you or to enhance you, that one does not have more rules. You got, just take it like other fruits. You can just open it on the front and uh, take the seed that you want and uh, help yourself. Okay? Because it has a lot of uh, remedy, it has of a lot of uh, benefit on the health area also. But uh, mostly, as a, a doctor in divinity, I rely on the spiritual uh, area so that uh, it can drive our natural areas. Because all the problem exists from the spiritual, that is why our natural is complicated, our natural is having a problem because the problem started in the spiritual. And therefore, I will come in the direction of the spiritual. Three areas that I give information from experiencing it, and then by the knowledge which I have acquired, and then by revelation which I'm being directed by the Spirit of God. Are you listening to me? So now, uh, for instance, uh, I want to help for those people who have not watched my video. You can go on and watch it. If you want to embark on the spiritual issue, and you want to use a, a getta pepe for spiritual purposes, number one, you have to open it you take it back when you open it you take it back okay you take it back like this and then you open it from behind you open it from behind once you open it from behind then you can bring it on the front 
Number two, you have to use something like a glass to keep your alligator pepper after you open it. Or a, a clear, a clean uh, plate that has no any color. Don't put it on a plastic plate. Don't put it on a plastic one and don't put it on a metal one. Okay? But use a glass and a clear glass or a glass that is a, a, a vessel that is a breakable vessel. Okay? Which is a, having a clear color. And by the grace of God, you can use the white one. It's very, very important. So you can select your seed and then you embark on the prayer which you want to embark. It can do a lot of things. Uh, make sure also you are not coming from having sex. If you are coming from having sex, uh, whether it is your wife or your friend or your fiancé, is uh, illegal and it's not acceptable just to take the, the alligator paper and begin to use it. You, have, you can cleanse yourself before you can start using it, okay? cleanse yourself you can take one seed and cleanse your but uh, if you have involved yourself on the sexual matter or sex uh, issues well, you need to use a uh, three seed uh, for your cleansing okay you start from your toes you hold the seed through the with the thumb finger and uh, the, the the ring finger and then you hold the seed ox expose the seed to touch your body okay it's very very small and very very challenging in the area of touching the body so you have to hold it and let me remind you when you are holding the seed and it drops it down you you are not allowed to pick it let it go because it, it will not be of useful if you pick it again but uh, if it goes on the ground it will start communicating direct uh, uh, about your wish to the universe okay so you have to let it you just pick another one so you clean from down to up and then once you finish like that, then you are going to uh, rotate your head uh, four times or sometimes three times, depending on the issue that uh, you are doing. Then uh, you are going to throw them somewhere where uh, a woman cannot uh, uh, reach or anybody cannot cross. You drop it somewhere. Just if you have a, a fence somewhere, you drop it around the fence where people rarely go. And it shall be a blessing to you because uh, you need a blessing in your life. So, uh, for instance, you can use Algeta Pepe to protect uh, uh, your money. You can use Algeta Pepe to protect your money. If you have a problem with the, uh, your money, uh, there are some people that when you give them money, they, they, when you give them money, they plan to destroy your money. Eh? There are some people when you give them money, they want to use it to make witchcraft, hmm? to use it for witchcraft purposes. Okay, so you can use a getter paper to protect your money. Let me show you. I'm 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 looking for some money here so that I can use it to demonstrate it. Uh -huh. so here, can use it to demonstrate it. So this is your money. You can use this money. Uh -huh. So for instance, uh, you have this money. You can use it to protect yourself. Use, uh, you, because there are some people who have a plan to use the money to tie your money or to w make a witchcraft with your money. Uh, use it. You take your money and you take seven seeds. You take seven seeds. You put it in your hand. Okay, and then you pray about it. Uh, thank God, the Maker of heaven and the earth, while you hold your money in your hand like this, you thank God and the seed here, and then you thank your chi. That's your guardian angel. Thank him. Appreciate God for allowing the angel to protect you. And then confess your sin if you have any any mistake. We are not perfect. Confess your sins and confess them and turn away from them and ask you for forgiveness and cleansing. Then um, uh, ask you for the mercy of the Lord. Then you can take the seed, hmm? your seven seed, you put in your, uh, um, um, in your mouth, okay? Yes. Put your mouth, the seven seed, 
once you put your mouth and the films you begin to chew them begin to speak speak on your money eh? this money eh? you will not be used against me when I give it to you I give my money to somebody uh, my money will not be used eh, against me my money will not work something against me you have to put your prayers on the money this is how you protect your money while you are chewing a getter pepper don't swallow uh -huh. don't swallow but you speak your wish speak good that uh, your money will protect protector your money will do good for you your money will refuse to do anything against you uh, when it goes out uh, you refuse to uh, you are good to work against you you pray you speak once you finish hmm, what you are going to do you are going to uh, you will not swallow the, the seed you will not swallow the seed you don't swallow hmm? are you going to take the seed and spit three times on the ground okay you spit three times on the ground Hmm? Yes. While you command your wish. I will give my money out and I will not die because of my giving. Like that. I refuse my money to work against me when I release it. My blessing, my good work will be a favor in my life. It will not work against me. You spit it again. You do it three times. Once you finish... This is how you protect your money. Uh -huh. Take the money and uh, go and look for, for, for some people outside there. The charity or the needy or the perfect way you can look for the arm. You give it to an arm as an arm. Okay? Give your money to arm as an arm. When you do a spitting, you do it, you spit first time, you do it, you spit the second time, you do it, you spit the third time. But at the time when you spit, this is how you are going to do it. I rejected my money to work against me. <coughs> it's a, I de demand that my money will work for me and it will not be used to work against me and to frustrate my financial life. He say, or if you cannot say he say, you can say amen. Or the he say is the Igbo, it means amen, okay? So you do it three times, and then you take your money to a place. Any denomination of money, you can take a thousand dollar, you can take any, any, any money that you can afford. Eh? Whether it is in shillings, whether it is in naira, whether it is in, uh, in dollars, whatever money that you can afford. That you can do it once. Once you do it once, uh, you have tied all your money in the future. Nobody will ever frustrate your money or take your money anywhere. It will bounce against the person. Okay? So this is how, my dear friends, you are going to protect your money. Eh? You can protect your money like that. Give it to the arms and it, it shall be well with you. You can also use a agata pepe to know um, your enemies. For instance, if there is a case that you don't know who is behind the case and you want to know them, you want to see them, God can help you to see your enemies through praying with agata pepe. Yes, you take the uh, take the four seed of agata pepe. You want to know who the person is. Take the four seed of agata pepe. Okay, once you take the four seed of a greater pepper, put in your hand and begin to pray. Pray and then after praying, uh, you you can you can do what you can. Uh, um, if you you are an, an a Nigerian, you can you you know the four market day, you know the the AK uh, Orie, Afo and Niko. You you know the four market day and you know the meaning. But uh, if you are not a Nigerian, because I'm not speaking to Nigerians only, I'm speaking to all the people in the world across the nation, the continents of the world, you can use uh, 
uh, north, south, east, west. Huh? The, the, the four seeds that you are going to pick represent uh, the, the four corners of the earth. Then you can, uh, if, if you can mention in the Igbo four market day, uh, the Eke, uh, Orie, Afo, and Nikwa, then you have done perfectly. It's, it's a good thing because uh, this is where the seed generates from. So uh, you do that, and then you have to anticlockwise your head four times. Once you do that and speak to that, speak that God will reveal to you the person in your hand. Speak that God will reveal to you the person who is behind your case. That you know the person who is behind your case. Then after you finish, go look a place where there is a, a three-corner uh, junction, a big junction, or four junction. Eh? Go there and drop the seed there while you pray to God that God will show you and open your eyes to see your enemies. When you do that, thank God and go back in your house. That night you are going to sleep, you will see the person in the dream. The person that you are going to see in the dream is exactly the person who is behind your case. But listen to me. When you do such a service, make sure that you didn't have anybody in the mind. Make sure that you didn't know exactly. Neither you don't have to wish, maybe so and so is the one behind my case. No. You are empty. You didn't know who was behind. So you do that. Once you do that, then you will see that uh, you have a dream. God will bring a dream. If you can't get a dream for the first day, the next day, go and do it again. Go and do it again. Hmm? If you can't see it, the third day, go and do it again. Do that in, in three days. When you do that and you, the third day and you didn't find it, go and do it the fourth day. When you do the fourth day and you have not seen the person, don't do it again. But be alert. Because within the first day and the seven days, God is going to open your eyes. You will have encountered the person in the dream. God will show you the person. And you see the person very clear. And you see a lot of details about the person. When you wake up, you will never forget. The, the thing will be in your mind, in your eyes. And you will know this is the person behind my case. Once you know that, then you don't have to confront the person because the case is spiritual. So you need to pray and know how to relate to the person because now you know that one is a dangerous person. This is a, uh, the information I will, I will finish here. Uh, thank you for all of you that have watched my video and those who are interested and those who are subscribed and those who are watching and sharing my videos and commenting to some other people. I believe by the grace of God I'm praying for you. And I know things are going to be better and things are going to work up for better. And don't lose heart. Fret not because your case has not been finished. God is still working on your case. And a few days, if you have not received a solution, a direction to my directive, I believe by the grace of God, you receive when I continue to watch, you receive one of these days out of this channel. You will get a solution. Thank you so much. You can subscribe. And it shall be a blessing to me. Thank you and may the Lord bless you. Okay.